Trey Ferraro. My name is James Sabalski, set to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. He sacrifices his body to block the shot. Tam Pierce moving it into the offensive end. Shot right in front. Off the post and in the net. They score. He beat him with the quick release there, James. That thing hits the post, sure. But it's his release that gets that puck away too quickly for the goalie. See, the goalie's hoping for the best here. This shot beats him clean, but it hits the goal post. Unfortunately, it bounces into the net. Tampere's got the game's first goal. Now they'll play in front. Best place to be, of course, is out in front where you swat it away with the stick in the defensive zone. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Shot makes the save. Scores! The captain comes through! Wow, did he hammer that? Too much power for the goalie to control, and it hits him and still goes in. has got an insurance marker here. They now lead by two in the second. Don't back off, though. Keep pushing ahead. And gaining momentum along the wing. Takes a shot. He scores! Well, what a great way to go into the end of a period. You score, you put a mark up on the board, and you know that you've really put a dent in the other team's confidence. With just seconds to spare. I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that traffic. Tampiers refused to let up that chokehold here in the late stages of this second period. Cold centers are set, face off ready to resume play. Jam in front, that's broken up. Here's a chance, right in the slot. Scores! Uh, gets their back in a little bit here. They still trail by two. They're going to really have to get after it to get themselves a real chance. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Still got to find two more goals, but they at least have one back. It gives them a little bit of hope, and the bench seems... Sends a pass over. Oh, off the post! Tampani's not going to stretch out this lead. It'll stay pretty tight as this puck hits the post. And it's a one-goal game as he buries it! You want to make this thing believable for yourself, you've got to get away from that two-goal deficit. They've done it here, and now they'll look for the tying goal. He didn't have much room up over the glove, but as soon as the goalie dropped into the butterfly, there was enough for him to put it into the top bin. Assad's third period deficit suddenly doesn't seem so insurmountable now. You can almost see the difference in the bench and the... Keep it out. Quick pass to Barack. And now he moves it quickly to Airholt. Cuts into the paint! Scores! Really good effort here to continue to push along, try and find a way to crack the defense. They've done it, and this game is tied. Absolutely clutch! Well, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Horry's got a little mojo back on their step after that goal here in the third. You work and you try and keep... Ilves got it in the defensive zone. From center, they get into the attacking area. Takes a shot. Scores! The deadlock's broken. That's a big goal, and they put him into the lead. Oh, 
just trickles over the goal line. The goaltender stopped most of it, just not all of it. Ilves coaches are pretty active on the bench there, Ray. What are you hearing? Well, they're happy that they've got the lead, but they want to make sure that no puck stopper. He'll keep it alive and moves it ahead. And he serves it across to Airholtz. Centering pass! And a stick break setup. He scores! And we're all tied up late here in the third. Well, you can never quit. Keep plugging away. You look for that time goal. They got it now. They chipped away and chipped away. It didn't seem like they were going to be able to make it all the way back. But this is a terrific comeback. Horry's late third period goal certainly opens up a lot of decision making for the coaches, doesn't it? It does. Welcome back, everyone. Well, it's time to put up or shut up for both the goaltenders and the players. It's time for the shootout. A lot of people lament the shootout, but look at this place right now. Crowd is on the... Gives them absolutely nothing. I think the goalies that are best at this are the ones that are the most efficient. They don't move a whole lot. They just really play their position solidly. his patience he gets it to the backhand and puts it in trailing by one an opportunity to try to get back into this shootout he's dialed in on that one so quick across the net doesn't matter if you deke or shoot on him, he's really good at this. Gives him absolutely nothing on that. It's amazing how many points are alive in this season. The goalie has to be good if you're going to collect some of them. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.